Hi, I'm Dick Spencer, Sales Director of CNO Tractors in the South of England. Thank you for joining us today for the first of our online live events featuring Can-Am. Today we're going to tell you about the exciting range of Can-Am off-road vehicles available from CNO Tractors. Can-Am quad bikes and side-by-side -side buggies have been designed to work in the most extreme conditions, whether that's working hard for you on the farm or if you're simply having some fun off-road. Today we're going to take you to our depots at Blandford in Dorset, Funtington in West Sussex and at Newport on the Isle of Wight where our sales teams are ready and waiting to give you a walk around a key product from the range of Can-Am vehicles and show you the features and benefits that they offer. Our sales team are online now ready and waiting to answer any questions that you may have. So as they say in the movies, let's get on with the show. Thank you. Can-Am's unique brake and traction control system features six technologies that ensure these machines outperform the competition. First is the anti-lock braking system, which provides improved maneuverability and controllability in even the toughest conditions. Second is the hill hold control. No more unwanted rolling with easier and smoother hill starts. Third is the hill descent control. Easy and controlled downhill riding, even with the most technical downhill sections. Front torque control automatically transfers power between the front wheels for improved grip and less effort while steering. The drag torque control significantly improves maneuverability and braking stability on slippery surfaces. And last but not least is a proven traction control system that optimizes power for improved controllability while cornering. These six technologies were designed so that you can have fun and stay in control. Experienced or not, there's a Can-Am for every kind of rider. Okay. Hello and welcome to CNO Tractors on the Isle of Wight. Today I'm going to just run you through the Outlander 650 V-Twin EFI ATV. This really is a cracking bike and I'm just going to run you now through some of the features because I believe this bike is uh, undersold into the market and really ought to be recognised more because it really is a fantastic bike. Okay, so starting off with this bike, it has a V-twin 650 engine knocking out 59 horsepower. Not a lot to see of the engine because all these guards keep it all covered in. Constant variable transmission in there behind all the guards so it keeps it all clean. There's a liquid cooled engine. The machine comes with three settings of power steering. Activated here with a new dash. And if you just want to have a quick listen to the engine. inch wheels, independent suspension all around. Trailing arms at the back of a fixed rear diff. Big storage in the back here, 2.9 litres, more than enough to get your foot trimmers and other bits and bobs in the back there and it's watertight around here you've got your foot brake here and your engine oil dipstick and your petrol filler cap here running you through some of the controls like I said it's a variable transmission in this okay but fly-by-wire throttle forward and reverse all done here but also what's really good here is you've got the switchable four-wheel drive or two-wheel drive just on a button it does run a viscous lock front differential, so it will put power to the wheel that has the grip. Double A-arm suspension. Huge 500 watt alternator that runs these lights, which are fantastic at the night 
but also allows you then to plug in some accessories in here should you need to. Now this is the XU package, which is the new name for what was the Pro. Carries a lot of weight on these machines. Carries 45 kilos on this front rack, on this particular machine, and 90 kilos on the rear. Six ply Carlisle tires on this machine with steel rims. That's part of the XU package, as is this heavy duty seat cover. So if the dog's jumping on it and their claws won't go through it. What also comes with the XU package this year is the air inlet for the engine and the CVT. It's all the way up here, the highest point on the bike, which gets all the clean air. Okay, so it's not sucking in air. Down around are these points, which all gets dirty, or around the front for the uh, CVT transmission. Take the seat off, nice light seat, but nice and strong. Everything is concealed from getting in all the muck and the dirt. The battery's really easily accessible up here. Gel battery on its side. One quick note, it's hard to see here with the bike, but these Can-Ams are all made with one piece of steel box that goes all the way around the engine as your frame. hardly any weld points. It's one steel wrapped around and then with the points welded on the edge to bolt it to. So it's very strong. The XU also comes with front full bar. And this is the new colour currently for this machine. It tows 750 kilograms, which is class leading as well. Has dual um, hydraulic brakes, which is a really nice feature on this machine. Yes, you've got the rear brake here, but it also uses the front brake. The front brake is also here, which also engages the back brake in a 60-40 split, much like your car. You've also got the handbrake, should you need to here, to lock it on. Like I said, all in all, this is a really good bike. Demos are available. If you want that bit more from a machine, really fuel efficient, please get in touch. See you tractors. Thank you. My name is Luke Bancroft. Uh, we're here on the family farm. The most recent utility vehicle we purchased was the Canam Traxter, which is a completely different league to the rest of the utility vehicles. We found it as a lot more reliable and travels the land a lot better and just a really good machine to have on the farm. And I think we're doing a really good job at providing a good machine that's very very practical for our uses that we have here on the farm. Yep. Hi, I'm Philip Pryor from c and Huntington and I'm going to tell you about the Can-Am Traxter Max. The HD8 is fitted with a twin cylinder V-twin 800cc petrol engine. The transmission is a pro torque transmission giving you two variable speeds and a selectable turf mode. It has electronic hill descent control with three work modes, eco, eco off and work mode. The dynamic power steering gives you a real nice easy pleasurable vehicle to drive. The suspension is a double A arm setup giving 25, mil 25 centimetres of suspension travel with twin tube gas shocks. Excellent braking power is provided by 220 mil ventilated disc brakes with hydraulic twin piston calipers. Seating is set up with two sets of three individual seats. The seats all fold, front seats and rear seats fold to give additional storage and extra space in the work cabin when you require it. 
All seats are fitted with full three-point seat belts, giving a good ergonomic drive. There are storage boxes available to fit under the seats and in the dashboard to give you more space and safe storage. The load bed features a self-manual tip, all sprung loaded to make life nice and easy, giving you 454 kilos of capacity in the load bed. There are optional sides and tool racks fitable to make the body a lot more durable and useful. The towing capacity of 1134 kilos can be used using the two inch receiver socket to fit a drawbar to the rear of the buggy. Thanks for joining us today. If you've got any questions, do get in touch. This is the Can-Am HD Pro-T. This is a homologated machine, road legal, with a top speed of 45 miles an hour. It's 50 horsepower with a twin Rotax engine. A Pro Torque transmission with electric hill descent control and dynamic power steering. It comes with a two ton winch, accessible from a control on the panel with front and rear dual suspension as you can see from the back you've got the dual rear suspension rams you've got room for a pickup hitch or clevis there's the lighting socket then the cargo box which can carry 680 kilograms the machine itself can tow up just over a ton petrol only machine for ultimate performance there's the engine, nice and easy to get to for service requirements. Thank you very much for your time today. If you've got any questions, please don't hesitate to get in touch.